with a bold goal to save the plants, save the planet. The Chicago Botanic Garden has scheduled the opening of the Daniel F. and Ada L. Rice Plant Conservation Science Center for September 23, 2009. The Granger Gallery will be open to the public from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. every day the garden is open. Windows into each of the nine laboratories line the gallery, offering a never-before-seen peek into the life of plant scientists. Beneath the windows are benches that explore botany concepts with text panels, slider panels, and models visitors can touch. The panels relate to research being performed in the corresponding lab and always end with a taking action panel that encourages people to help save plants by making small changes. All life depends on plants, and the Plant Science Center helps to explain why we need to save plants in order to save the planet. The Dixon Tallgrass Prairie Seed Bank Preparation Laboratory is one of nine laboratories in the center. After seeds are collected and quarantined in the seed quarantine chamber, they are brought into this lab where healthy seeds are separated from other plant material. The seeds are cleaned and analyzed for moisture content, weighed, and counted. The garden is working to preserve nearly 100 million seeds from 250 species of the tallgrass prairie over the next 10 years. This living seed bank facility will store seeds for the future, as well as provide for current research and restoration projects. Seed banking, conserving and storing species away from their original habitats, enables plants to escape threats imposed by destructive habitat changes, including urbanization, climate change, invasive species, overharvest, and pollution. After the seeds are cleaned, about 25 seeds are sent to the Reproductive Biology Laboratory where they are germinated to ensure they are viable. The remaining seeds are slowly dried to 15% humidity and 58 degrees Fahrenheit. They are then carefully labeled and packaged in large, heat-sealed foil containers before being stored in the Dixon National Tallgrass Prairie Seed Bank at negative 20 degrees Celsius. From the field to the freezer, the process takes approximately six months. These scientists are in the Harris Family Foundation Plant Genetics Laboratory, where we unravel plant mysteries with DNA technology. One of the many scientists and graduate students who will use this laboratory is Dr. Jeremy Fant, a conservation scientist in molecular ecology population genetics. Dr. Fant uses a combination of molecular and quantitative techniques to better understand the level and distribution of genetic diversity within rare and endangered species. This student in the Garden's Plant Biology and Conservation PhD program is studying bees to determine their population patterns. Learn more about the Plant Science Center and view the beautiful green roof garden atop the building at the opening on September 23rd.